Hi, I'm Mike Galloway. Welcome to today's Hardcore's Gear Guide. Today we're talking about our man cave. The first and most impressive feature about our man cave is the ability to withstand lots of weight. You know how many layout blinds that I've gone through in my lifetime because every time you get in and out of a, of a layout blind it's like doing dips. And this is the weak spot. This is what breaks on you, not on the man cave. Next feature of the man cave that I <coughs> I truly love is that the bottom is waterproof. You've got six inches of waterproof. This doesn't mean go set it up in a pond, but if you're in some sheet water, you're going to be fine. The water's not going to wick into your blind and get everything wet. We start down here, we'll work our way up. Here is a zipper at the bottom. And you're like, why do you want a zipper at the bottom of your man cave? Well, with the man cave, our inner structure completely removes. So at the end of the season, you're going to be able to take your inner structure out. You're going to be able to hang the man cave up and hose it out. And everything that's inside, you unzip the bottom and everything will come washing out the bottom. Makes for real easy cleaning. Obviously, we have our stubble straps. So you can make sure that the entire blind is stubbled. Listen, I always tell people if I spend a half hour putting my decoys out, I spend an hour grassing in my blind. Next feature on the man cave, before I have to climb inside, is we have wire mesh. This wire mesh is not held together by Velcro. So if you want to make sure somebody's hidden, just straighten out their mesh. If you're the guy calling and you need to see, all you need to do is bend the wire. And now, the part of your body that you need to be covered is covered. The part that you need to see, you can see. When you open up the man cave, the first thing that strikes you is how much room there is. It's impressive. It's been built so you can lay in it all day very comfortably. It even comes with a removable pillow. This pillow can be used up top or it can be used down at the bottom for your lumbar support. The seat itself is a hammock style seat. I'm going to flip it over here. If you want your seat nice and tight, you just tighten the hammock. If you like it nice and loose, leave it the way it is. The right side of the door in the man cave has your flag port or your flag pocket. I always, always am looking for my flag. Now, finally, I have learned to put it in the pocket it was meant to be there. Every time you open up your blind, you'll know exactly where your flag's at. On the right side, you have a pocket for flagging. If you're left-handed, you have one on the left side. The man cave itself comes with a black bag. I use mine for shells, or actually I use mine for empties. It velcros on to either side, so at the end of the day, your blind's nice and clean. All you have to do is empty out the all you have to do is empty out the bag. Those are the main features of the man cave. Remember, it's constructed well. You can stand on it. You can set it in sheet water, and it's not going to wick and get everything inside the blind wet. You're able to move around. There's plenty of shoulder room. You have the accessory of the pillow for underneath your head or underneath your back. Um, and you have the wire mesh so you can see through or totally uncover your face. Thanks. Have a good day.